Good afternoon, everyone. This is Marie and Mello again. Mello is not, she's outside, but I'm in here. I'm not feeling too well today. For a couple of days now, I don't know what happened. My big feet, big toe has been just hurting me. You know, I didn't hit it or anything, but it just kept hurting me all of a sudden. And then I couldn't walk on it, so eventually I couldn't wait for the weekend to be over so I could go see the doctor. Go to see the doctor, but boy, I'm telling you, doctor didn't do anything, so they tell me to go see a, a podiatrist, which I already have one. So I went to the podiatrist, and I'm telling you, they did a very good job, but I'm suffering with it right now. But they told me that I would be going through this situation. This is the big, this is the toe. There it is. It's right there. So they did a shot. They gave me two shots in it all over in the bones. So they took some x-ray. And they said they didn't see anything, but I have to have it elevated on the bed for a period of while. So I'm here. How are you? How is everyone? Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, wherever you are. Marie, love you all. I just want to say something this morning. I want to talk about how we accept each other. To accept someone else means that I stop criticizing that person and stop saying and thinking negative things about them. It means that I look at them through the cross of Jesus and be prepared to love them in spite of their faults and their shortcoming. This is something I myself, Marie, fail to do sometimes, time and time again. The next thing, or the next time you struggle to accept someone, remind yourself of your own sinfulness and lack of love and ask God to set you free from these sins. Always try to see the best in everyone, especially your partners. One who cares and crosses your part, if you can manage this, then it becomes so much easier for you to accept and no longer magnify their fault. But rather than to become aware of your own faults, when you will no longer look down on other people, but be willing to accept them just like God accepts you. I think you all should think about it. Let's pray. Lord, grant that the things that I say other than will always reflect the love and acceptance and not judgment unto others. Forgive me if I judge, O oh Father God. Forgive each and every one of us if we judge each other. Judge ye not that ye might be judged. Good afternoon again, good morning, good evening everyone. Wherever you are, Marie loves you. And I just want to say, Today, because I'm in the bed, I have a lot of things to reflect on. I, my only daughter died six years ago, coming December 26. I try not to think about it, but it always comes in my mind. And the reflection of it happens now because... I'm sitting on the bed and I have a picture of her that comforts me and it's just staring at me and smiling and while I'm speaking to you now, I, 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 I see that beautiful face smiling at me. So I'm sorry. I'm 
sorry. I didn't mean to get emotional. Please forgive me. It is hard when you lose someone, especially she's your only child. And whenever I think of her being gone, I feel it here and I feel it at the bottom of my stomach. It's hard to express to you if you don't understand what I'm saying. Or it's never happened to you or you never lose someone so close. I lost my father. I lost my mother and I miss them much. But there's this something special that gets to me when I think of her. And I didn't come on here for that, but by just looking at the picture, staring at me in the bed while I'm speaking to you, if you can see it, it's probably over there. There it is over there, mm -hmm. right there. Staring at me and smiling and smiling. And because of that, it got me emotional. So forgive me everyone, enough of that. How are you? <laughs> how are you how is everyone i haven't been on here a couple of days now because i haven't been feeling too good but god is in the midst of everything and we have to just come to him and pray and thank him for another blessed and bountiful day that he had made so let us all rejoice and be glad in it i won't be staying long all i want to say to everyone please subscribe thumbs up share and remember to hit the notification bell that whenever you see everything will comes up to you please subscribe it is free to subscribe it is free to thumbs up it is free to share to others there's no cost to it so please share subscribe and thumbs up and you know leave a little comment and let me know how all of you feel about me sometimes. I am on here doing this to show each and every one of you sometimes that we are human. And no matter what happened in our lives, there are times when we get a little bit down. Ah, yes, we get a little bit down. But we have to just shake off our shoulder Wake up, smile, laugh, and remember that we are alive. So thanks to the Almighty for that. I want to say thank you to Jamaica Good Life, Randy Pottinger, for helping me do something on my YouTube here that I didn't understand what to do. I haven't been bothering him that much anyway, but he did something real fantastic for me. Thanks to Gretel for being a good friend. We correspond and she's doing our YouTube and our YouTube is Empress G. Go over to her and thumbs up and subscribe to her, please. She's in Canada. She do a lot of cooking. Also go over to Cold Smith TV in Jamaica and quite a few others. Subscribe to them. Listen to them, especially Coles. Coles is so funny. And go to my son. He's not my biology, biological son, but he's like a son to me. His name is Rondi Pattinger, and he has a YouTube for years now, Jamaica Good Life. And I'm telling you, it is a good program to watch. It is a good program to watch. So go over there and watch him and subscribe to him, please. And I want to say hi to all the other subscribers in the world. Whoever you are, wherever you are, blessing, blessing. So I'm going to leave now. I just came to say hi. Remember, subscribe, comment, share, thumbs up. And remember, Marie and Melo love you all. <laughs> yes, I do. And Please watch my video to the end. Be careful. Wherever you're going, 
whether you're going to church, you're going to work, you're going out, you're going to spend time, you're going to the movie. Thumbs up, always. And be good to yourself. Be careful. And if you can't be good, <laughs> as Marie said, be e careful. God love you, and so do I. Thank you very much. Bye-bye. Love each and every one of you. Take care of yourself until I see you again or until I speak to you again. Have a blessed and awesome day. Marie loves you all. Bye-bye. 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 Yes.